Welcome to today's Qigong flow. We will be doing a movement called the Swimming Dragon. So bring both hands together by the chest. Take the hands out to the right side. Shift the weight to the right. Then take the hands to the left and shift the weight to the left. Turn your head in the opposite direction. So your hands go right and your head goes left. Shift the weight, turn the head. This will shift the spine and open the tendons. Swimming Dragon is said to increase longevity and keep the body youthful and healthy into old age. Shift the weight, turn the head in the opposite direction. And then we'll do it with a wide leg stance. So stand a little wider, wider than your shoulders. Shift your weight to the right and shift the weight to the left. Head goes to the left as you're shifting to the right. Breathe into it. Shifting the weight one way and turning the head the other way is said to help the left and right brain find harmony and balance. Now increase the range of motion with a bigger shift to the right and a bigger shift to the left. Push that inner arm through and across the body and stretch and open the sides and the arms, upper back, between the shoulder blades. And now start to swim through the spine. Swim through the spine, up through the neck and shoulders, all the way out and through the arms. This will now unlock tension and unwind the spine. The energy that moves in the back is said to move like a snake or a serpent. So bring the arms up over the head and back down as you release. And just pulsate and undulate the spine laterally to coax all that energy out. Bring the hands back to the heart and the feet together. Take a deep breath and we'll do the swimming dragging with the feet together, knees slightly bent, push the arms out slightly to the right, and back to the center, go back and forth here, between the rib cage, shoulders and spine, all the tendons opening. It also brings a good flow of energy into the internal organs, especially the bladder, spleen and stomach. And back and forth, turning the head in the opposite direction as the hands. Now we'll do a full swimming dragon movement. We're going to make a big circle around the body, pushing out to the right side, coming over to the left, come across now by the solar plexus, come down to the lower abdomen, and then up by the throat, and then we'll start our swimming dragon movement hips and the spine into that snake-like movement. Take the hands up over the head and come all the way up into your toes. Inhale and then exhale back down. Big circle around in the front of the body. Push the hands to the right, head and hips go left. Hands go right, head and hips go left. Lower body, all the way up to the upper body. And then start to swim through the body and the spine. Bring the hands up over the head. Take a deep breath up onto the toes. Let the energy rise up. And then down to the chest. Big circle in front of the body. Gather chi into your space. As you do the swimming dragon movement, it spirals and circulates that energy through the meridian centers and the pathways in the body. And now swim up and out through the arms, unlocking tension, freeing up that energy to flow into and deeper the body and the joints, all the way over the head onto the toes, and back down to the center of the chest. One more time, big circle. Arms press out to the left, hips go to the right. Then arms go left, hips go right. And back and forth, letting the chi unspiral and unwind. Swimming dragon now, starting by the face. 
with the knees bent and then swim all the way up over the head onto the toes and back down to the chest. Take a deep breath here with the palms of the chest. Shake it out a little bit. Shake out the wrist and the hands. Shake out the shoulders. And now bounce into your heels and allow the whole body to shake out tension and tightness to relax and release. And now take both hands up over the head. Hold one thumb, come up onto your toes and drop down and shake. And just allowing any tension or tightness to release out through the arms. Do it again, hold the thumb and drop and shake. Inhale through the nose and exhale out through the mouth. Come up onto the toes, bounce into the heels and shake. This helps to clear out tension and tightness in the body. Wherever you hold holding tension, just let it release and relax. Take a deep breath and hold the thumb. And then bounce into the heels. If you hold the thumb, this is the pressure point for the lung meridian. The lungs often carry stress or tension or sadness or depression. And so this helps to clear emotional energy and stress. It brings you back into that place of balance and free flow. Just notice now how your body feels. I hope you enjoyed that short Qigong practice. I'll see you soon.